Hey youans, welcome back to my channel. It's Winnie BLV, Mouth of the South. No intro, no outro. It's just this ho. Today, not one, not two, not three, not four, but five, yes, five micro bag reveal. So excited. And I'm also going to show you at the end of the video my bag of the day and what's in it. I don't know what all the is about. It's fanfare. It's crazy. It might be because my hair's just sticking up all over. All right. The first one I remember telling you guys last video that I did watch a movie that had was on Netflix. I think it came out two weeks ago. Ashton Kutcher and Reese Witherspoon. Tennessee gal. Hey girl. Hey girl. Hey. We're best of friends. Actually we're not. Anyway I wish we could be though. I kind of think she would be fun but I don't know. I've also read things that she's kind of mean and nasty. I guess all of us have our down moments where we're like, rah, 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 get away. I can imagine being famous and being attacked from all sides. People noticing you, that would suck. I've always said, give me fortune over fame, but it takes fame to get the fortune. Anyway, anyway, in that movie, if you've seen the movie, it's, I can't even remember <laughs> what it's called, but it's brand new on Netflix. Uh, she's staying at his house. This lady walks in. She's the coolest. I think her name is Minka. But anyway, she's the coolest character in the whole movie. She's the best bad the best wardrobe, the best outfits. In the end, she buys Reese a new Louis Vuitton roller bag with the, you know, little whatever they're called. They say it over and over again because she has an old jank one. Anyway, she buys her a new one to send her home in, and I just love that. But in the middle of the movie, she does meet her out for drinks, and she is carrying this bag, girl. This very bag. This little, why am I not in the middle? Okay, this tiny Dooney and Burke it bag with the hearts from circa 2003-ish, 5-ish, somewhere around in there. I know that I had, I want to say it was 2003 or 4. I know that I had all these bags in gray, a purple gray. I had red. I had pink, bubblegum pink. I'm looking at it right now. I had the white off-white version, but I never had one. I had like the barrel in that white one. I've sold them all except for a couple, but I never had the black one with the hearts in this little tiny. It's kind of like a mini HL Speedy, the little nano speedies. It's kind of the size of that. Now, this is the thing about the Dooney and Burke. They go a little cloudy and milky, but what this is, is a very yellowy canvas, or not canvas, but coating. And that's what it does over time. It dulls it separates from the cotton that's behind it because this isn't leather underneath. It's just a, a cotton bag. And says what? Hey girl, hey, was telling me that she has a video, which I'll link her down below. She has a video where she took the coating off. She bought one of these just so she could try to take the coating off. But I love this. I found it in white, but I'd already had one in white. And the girl in the movie, the cool girl had this one. And I was like, no, she was carrying it like this. And I was like, oh no, 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 no. I need this. Maybe I'll get this one on to insert a clip. I loved, I was like, oh, that's girl on the hunt. Did I pay too much for this? I paid about $100 more than I should have, if that says anything to you. Was it just $100? No, but I did pay over $100 what everybody else is paying for these vintage bags, but I felt like people were going to be like snatching them up because it was in the movie and the girl was carrying it. It looked so good on her. Okay, that is my first micro bag. <gasps> Very excited about this. Will I take the coating off? Maybe. I'm a little scared too, but I know how because Suz did it and she's amazing. And so if she can do it, I think I can do it too because I believe in her and I know she believes in me and that's how players gotta be. Okay, so I don't know why I refer back to uh, old songs all the time. Now, I still owe you four other micro mini bags. And when I tell you that these bags are micro and the cutest things I've ever seen, I'm must blame Autumn. They come in one package and they are by a company called Charles and Keith and shout out to Renee. My girl Renee, she has already said like be on the lookout for Charles and Keith. It's more affordable. You should be buying affordable bags and I'm like girl I'm way ahead of you. But yes, Charles and Keith, there are four miniature bags in this box girl. I kid you not. I shit you not. <laughs> 
but I promised you five and five is what you shall get. Ta-da! OMG, look at this, the presentation. Now, from the looks of this, you would think, oh my God, that's only two, and also, that looks very expensive. No, ma'am, no, ma'am. As a matter of fact, I paid more for this one singular vintage Dooney and Burke bag than I did for all four in this cool presentation of these four micros. Okay, the first one is this little guy right here. It has a little tiny chain. God, guys. <laughs> The micro bag love is strong with this one. This one is kind of iridescent a little bit. It's kind of blue, kind of it is. It's got a little top handle with an antique brass chain and look at the back, Charles and Keith on the back. Oh my gosh, I love it. Look how cute. It's also got a tiny, tiny, tiny little strap inside. Oh my God, we love a tiny strap on. Okay, did you think that was it? Where are the other two bags? You promised us five, you bitch. Wait a minute, hold it, hold up. There's a drawer. My kids hate how I say drawer. But inside of here, girl, is two more miniature micro bags. Can you guys see it? Okay, that one just fell out, that's okay. Take two. Okay. Shit. Anyhow, the other two boxes in the draw are this little Chanel-y looking, right? Tweed number. Oh my God, so friggin' cute. Look at this. It almost looks like a little tiny Chanel vanity case or something with Oh my God. You guys are gonna want one of these. I just know you are a set. Now, they make it in two colorways. This one I got with the light blue and then there's a teal quilted. Which I was like, my God, do I need honey? No, no, she doesn't. But one is plenty for everyone. You know how I have that thing. I don't really have that thing, but in my mind, I think, oh my God, I love that one. I would love more. And I gotta, yeah, that thinking. Quit stinking thinking but anyhow yes would this cross body on me no ma'am look i can't even oh she's a teddy bag like just a little teddy bag no 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 i can't carry her like that but she's a shoulder moment hi there she is oh my god she's so freaking cute this is my favorite it's everything i love <laughs> it is such a what a vibe a mother effing vibe okay and so the other bag is actually very cute as well it is really in there it has a really cool chain which does get longer oh god girl that's what she said does it get any longer yes it's got this little tiny like charm thing well they're all charms a little bag charm a little tiny heel barbie's heel God, I love it. Okay, it's got a little plastic on it. It's got a little kiss lock or S lock. Not a kiss lock, S lock. Like that. And bada bing, bada bang, more chain inside. And then just close her back up. Look at this, how effing cute. I swear, I wish I wasn't so big I could cross body her, but you can't adjust these. So this is gonna have to be a shoulder moment too because she's a boob bag. She's just, hey, hanging around with my boobs all day. Yes, things Bill says on the weekends. So yeah, this one comes way up. Girl, so yes, isn't. I know, I am flabbergasted by this purchase. Who put me in touch with this? I wonder. Let me think. Two guesses and the first one does not count. It's Autumn. Autumn Beckman put this on the radar for me and I love, I absolutely love. I love the gals because they do whenever there's a tiny bag anywhere that they can find on the internet, at a store, whatever, they always send me like the link, the pictures. You might need this. So I love that because as y'all know, I love a, a TBE or a TBF. Tiny bag flex or some tiny bag energy. I love this little. I mean, it's jewelry for the bag. Yes, I love it. I just, I'm blown away. I, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of this company, but Charles and Keith, it did take a while to get here. I don't know where it came from. Let me, I'm, I'm assuming maybe Asia somewhere. I don't know. But yeah, it doesn't say on the little card. I don't know if it's, maybe it's, um, you know, maybe it's UK or something. I sent something to Meredith like 20 days ago 
one and that bee still hasn't made it so yeah thank you to the mail for i got her gift though her her package or whatever like six days like boom from australia to us nothing but a thing from us to australia you're gonna wait a while it's let's wait a while before she gets it i just went into a janet jackson crazy moment Woo! now my boobs coming out i'm <laughs> just kidding they're already out <laughs> guys thank you so much for coming by today checking out my five that's right five micro bag reveal i am so excited i don't know tell me in the comments what you think and do you think i should take the coating off of this or does it look okay the ends by the way are you know they don't see as much action <laughs> my end does but anyhow the ends don't see as much action so you're not gonna really I, I thought this was in really good shape i would say somebody bought it you know like me and said oh this is so cute i'm gonna carry the hell out of her and then up on a shelf she went story of my life all right thank you guys again for coming by if you would hit the subscribe hit the like button also yeah yeah do tell me if you think i should take this coating off i don't know about that comment down below get my box roll around i have some things for sale i will have these charles and keith little tiny bags linked oh girl get over there i want to say 165 for the four right it's so cute if for any other reason it's a conversation piece did i need more micro bags yes because i plan on doing a christmas tree this year again with nothing but micro bags so now my micro bags have a purpose you see <laughs> yeah always thinking ahead okay anyway if y'all would do me a huge favor please if y'all see my husband girl don't tell him nothing bye okay i promised you last video that we would change into da -da, the bag of the day and it is the micro i'll have this linked as well if you guys didn't get a hold of this candy pink there are some other colors i can't be bothered i love saying i can't be bothered thank you dale thank you all of australia for that gift i cannot be bothered to pay attention to what those colors are but there are some other colors too but this one was my favorite and that's all I can think about. So I was going to show you what fits in her. Sadly, I had my firkin. She's here. Get up here, girl. Get up. But anyhow, she still has my cosmetic bag because all of what's in here and the cosmetic bag fits in this firkin. I know, right? So anyway. <laughs> okay, so I will not do that with voodoo, baby voodoo. All right, inside. What fits? I have, dun, 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 thank you, Devin, who got me this Gucci little Bananarama. What's it called? Bananagon? I can't remember, but I love it. It's got a little cash in there. I hardly ever have cash. Don't tell the husband. My little journal that I just don't really use. Why do I have it in my bag? I don't know. My coin or, sorry, clay. Yes. These, I don't care what kind of bag she has. I, Mama's little helpers. Sometime I might get out crazy and I need, feels like, take a pill, you're acting crazy. Okay, yeah, so they're always with me. And this that my friend gifted me, which I continue to love, this little wallet. Mwah. So that is everything that's in there, girl, but all fits in there very nice. I bet I could get something else. Girl, that's what she said. And I don't really, tell you the truth, really need this i just like it so much i don't know it's such a flex and it's so if i need to jot things down but then i put stuff in my notes on my phone but i don't know i don't know it's just something about girls we just love our stationery and guys as people some of us luxury lovers we love our stationery and our accoutrement all that goes with that and i am no different okay i hope you guys have a great rest of the day scent of the day it's replica again but today she went a little off kilter and decided to do flower market because I was feeling a little springy and this is good I'm gonna do I'm gonna do another spritz oh so good the thing about these is they start out great as something and then they end up something great at the end different does that make sense okay bye
Hors d'oeuvres, anyone? Aperitif? Maybe some a tray of micro bags for your pleasure. Miatch!